Do you know that Jesus was made a little lower than the angels? Okay, let me show you something. We now have an important truth to understand about Jesus Christ and the Incarnation. When he stepped out of eternity into time and took on human form, he suddenly took on an existence that was lower than the angels. As the creator, he was the one who created the angels and the whole spiritual ring. But after his birth into humanity, he was restricted to time and space. He was lower than the angels. Philippians chapter 2 from verse 5 to 11 explains this concept in details. In the Greek, the word used for his voluntary self-emptying means that he temporarily set aside the full benefit of deity to put on humanity. He was suddenly subjected to things like hunger, thirst, weariness, sorrow, pain, suffering and death. He lived with a full array of human emotions and limitations. The fuller list of what Jesus set aside to be made lower than the angels is astounding. God became a man, eternity stepped into time, heaven came to earth, omnipresence was suddenly restricted to time and space, omniscience was born into a manger and had to learn all the things like ordinary people. The creator became part of the creation. The righteous judge became the victim of unrighteousness. The self-emptying extended to the point of death, even death on a cross. So here is the great mystery. When Jesus took on humanity, he was suddenly vulnerable to the schemes, deception, temptations and attacks of the evil one. Yet he did not yield for even a moment. As the second Adam, he won back what the first Adam forfeited at the fall. The love of Jesus for lost humanity compelled him to go to extraordinary measures to reach and to save that which was lost. Never question the love Jesus has for you.